purchasing a ticket right now. <laughs> we hate people over here. Only curry gums allowed in. Big facts. Gotta have chicken. Oh, some beef skewers. Um, you know what? I'm gonna do some shrimp too. Shoot some shrimp. Some shrimp going in there. Season it with some Cajun. Yeah, you know. Uh, anything else I have to say before? Any more preamble? No. Let's get it. All right. Saturday YouTube. Yo, we haven't got an, uh, an announcement for Kubera coming back yet. <laughs> what is it coming back? Webtoons. Why are you guys waste? Announce it so I can start posting these. I'm just stockpiling them. All right, let's get it. So, all right. There's no one who will eavesdrop within my detecting range so you can talk freely. Vayunim, did you also receive news? Yes, it seems they picked out the most. What the? What? Where that? Oh, sorry. Sorry. Yes, it seems they picked out the people you were most likely to contact and sent them the news. If that's true, he was attacked by Nastikas. He must have de he must have decided that he it would have been better to wait for me somewhere safe instead of walking around knowing that he's being targeted. Utah. He I guess we should be grateful that Indra so happens to not be around. I like when he's not around. Like the goddamn video. Yeah, tell him again. I'm buying tickets to Canada tomorrow. Hey, come through. <laughs> Y'all can sleep over. They trying to have the 12 weeks like with TOG. Ugh, that's too many weeks in my opinion. But hey, man. It gives me more content to stockpile on the Patreon, I suppose. It, looks, it makes my Patreon look better. But hey. Anyway, let's go. It is possible that the Ashura clan will also hear the news and come running. I'll bet belatedly. I like I like how I like how they phrase that. That's how, that's some shit I would do in an essay just to sound extra smart. <laughs> that's how that's how I'd be wording shit. I'd be wording it extra flowery just because put a little razzle dazzle on the sentence. But it will be hard for them to arrive faster than us. She looks a little shocked. What is it? Hurry up and take my hand. <laughs> that face though. It's comedy. I'll need that. Actually, I can make a bigger version. I'll, I'll do it later. All right. Uh, I'm, thank you. I'm in your care. Whoosh. <gasps> One last God who bear a story in art by Curry Gum. Season 3, episode 323. 929. 920, chapter 9. So there's Utah. He in the tree. He trapped. Free my mans. Let him go. Even though I waited quite a while, my eyes show no signs of regenerating. Their regeneration speed hasn't been slowed solely because they were eaten. Is it an environmental effect? Are the trees surrounding me the cause? I think my server form is suppressed due to that item. I only wore it around my neck, but before I knew it, my whole body was covered. Didn't he say there were, there were a few more? I had no idea they had something this big. Yeah. They put you in a straitjacket? You're free my man, Utah. Free the man, them. Free the man, them. Free the man, them. All right, flash, flash. I think last week she was saying th those little flashes and like currents of whatever energy was him trying to break out himself with his own abilities. So, even with the use of this transcendental, the damage is minuscule. It seems that I will have to use up all of my all of the vigor I just recovered to sever this completely. Must have the most eloquent of vernaculars to expound your exquisite skills with the quill. <laughs> I got you. Uh, what I always tell people, my lexicon is rather extensive. Oh, yes, indubitably. But I, I do do that a lot. I used to show off a lot in English class a lot. Because I do not speak like that. <laughs> I can, but I just don't naturally. It was a mistake to follow along so completely just because the clan protected me without employing such tricks in N2-3. I mean, man, this, don't trust nobody. Only trust Lee's. And even with her... Nah, trust Lee, trust Lee, trust Lee. Like, don't trust nobody, bro. I would have trusted these ninjas. Man, I was watching Simi play Mafia the other day. And I can't remember exactly what happened, but I'm like, this, them MC about to get set up. And as soon as he walked in that building and they surrounded him with guns, I'm like, man, you see me? I'm a distrustful ass nigga. You're not catching me like that. You gotta just kill me. You gotta just catch me slipping. I'm taking my grandma to church. Ah, there he is! Pop, pop, pop! You're not. I'm not. I'm not showing up nowhere. <laughs> You're not getting me. <laughs> I don't trust shit. No one does, or nothing. No one say. 
Uh, should have been more careful and taking into account their reaction might be different due to Taraka's growing stronger. It's futile with your level of power. It would just be a waste of vigor. Oh, the area of Vata Kanara. Yep. I thought you couldn't use any transcendentals at all. Offensive transcendentals at all. To think you were still hiding some tricks, even if they are weak. It's not like I was hiding it. Right. According to your claims, you became stronger for some unknown reasons and this skill became unusable. Your partial Sura form has also changed a lot from what I last saw. Up to third stage, you were at least imitating the developmental skills of Arakshasha, but that is no longer the case. Yo, 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 big in the universe, yep. Speaking like F and Shakespeare, yep. They always do you to, you, do you to bad, yeah. That's the influence from watching my Mafia streams, <laughs> yes. But I'm just, I'm just like, hey man. Yeah, just come with us, it's fine. Just take your eyes out and weaken yourself. How about I don't do that? And I stay at full power, and we deal with the Tarakas because I don't trust nobody. How about that? How about that? Again, again, that's just me. Yuta's a nicer person, I think. I think? Is he nicer? He, like, eats people and stuff. Is that... I don't know. Maybe I am nicer, technically. On a technicality? <laughs> on a very literal sense? Because I, I don't be eating people. <laughs> I'm not the Homelander clone. I don't be eating babies. What? Why? Are you wait? Why are you doing this? I believe I was cooperative enough. The reason I obediently followed Kamadu was because I trusted you. Before you arrived, Taraka attacked this the place right where our rock shells are taught. Chatan repelled her, but he, he arrived late, and a, a, about a hundred clans mates had already been killed. There were children with uh, there was children with quite promising talent amongst them, along with two Nasticas. Skill issue. Get mo better. Skill issue. Um, that can't cost up an example. Yep. Uh, Aravata Kinara. This is the same bitch who betrayed her ex lover over her name. So I started set up coming a mile away, right? Ninja like me never getting caught lacking. To be fair, if I was Utah, I'd be compliant just because I know I could air that chance if I wanted to. Well, clearly, clearly, yeah, you got to think about it. You see, some, this is what happens sometimes when you're too strong. When you're too strong. And I'm going to use a very generic example that most people can understand. When Goku arrived to Namek, the only person there that was stronger than him was Frieza. But what did Vegeta say? Being the strongest isn't always enough. You have to have the strategy, the cunning, and the... The hardcore ability to go where you need to go. And what happened to Goku? A body snatch, just like Kroha. A body snatch from Ginyu. That had nothing to do with strength. That had everything to do with you being unprepared and letting your guard down. You gotta be ready. Don't just, just because you can whoop somebody's butt does not mean they don't have a strategy to subdue you, take you out, or limit what you can do. You gotta be ready. There were children among them. Yeah, I read it already. But they were helpless when faced with Taraka's unexpected strength. Mm -hmm, she's, she's listening. And the cause for that abnormal strength delivered itself to my doorstep. How else was I supposed to act? You said that your abnormal strength would soon disappear, but for me, that's just lip service. Why you became stronger in the first place, how it could be reversed, you were clearly unable to explain the manner, the cause, the manner, and timing of it. So I have no choice but to choose a surefire way to weaken you right now. As long as you're confined here, you can perform. You can neither take suraform nor regenerate. Hmm, interesting. Kinara only setting herself for failure. We lit. To be fair, yeah, yeah, sorry. You mean the original Aravata were never lovers? Kinara didn't realize Aravata liked her until a long time after the steal. Aravata and Kinara were a pair, though. I'd be strong as Anata with the most cautious person you'd ever see. That's kind of how I'd be. See, yeah, you're right. Like, I'm the type of person, if I had powers in real life, people wouldn't, I wouldn't be flaunting them. Even in, like, in a costume. I'm not telling anybody I have powers. You gotta catch me using them. I'm, I, I think I'm home alone. I'm super speed. And you're just like, what the fuck's happening? I'm like, oh. Hey, yo, bro, I got a speed force. Don't tell nobody. Like, <laughs> you gotta just catch me. I'm not telling a soul. <laughs> That would that wouldn't pose an issue for you if you had the ability to break out in this human in this human form. 
of this in human form. But it's impossible to her current level. So the Rakshasa abruptly attacking me was done on her orders. After all, to choose an item suitable for my current level, I understand. I acknowledge that you can't trust me. I also understand your reasoning for doing this from your position as king. However, the Tarakas running rampant will is also not my will, since it will also put Lees in danger if they do. But I, ha I do not hold the authority to stop them. I only affect their strength. I have no real control over them. I am a mere figurehead, not a true king. Will this move her, though? Will this argument move her? Not gonna lie, if I was strong as ish, everyone else would probably know as well and come up with countermeasures trying to catch me lacking. Yeah, I mean... You got kryptonite for Superman. Like, I'm just not... It's just, I just... Again, I'm just not telling anybody. If you know, you know. If you figure it out, you figure it out. But I'm just going to keep it on the DL. I'm running to Mexico. Super speed like the Flash. And, you know, I'm not letting anyone see me. Will this argument move her? Ooh, that's some kick. That's that Ray and nephew, baby. Okay. I will wait here without resisting. So, please, once Elise arrives, allow us to meet. She is the sole human who holds the key to overcoming this predicament, as well as the biggest reason I keep gouging my eyes out. Curry Gob's not going to let them ha live happily ever after. I know her. I know her too well. Lee's is honestly rubbing off on him? I think so. Oh, honesty, honesty. You think her, like, yeah, I think maybe her good natured, you know, heart and spirit is starting to take its effect on him, even though he's still, you know, a little more cautious. Please don't stop her. And then she looks. I don't believe I don't believe her already. I don't know what she said, but I don't believe her. Shut the door. She walks out. Keep guarding here, Chatan. Understood. Visitors have arrived. Please head to the entrance. She's already here. Kubera League is moving quickly. I don't think it I already knew it wasn't her. I already knew it wasn't her. It's not her. The ones who arrived here are Who? Who at the door? Hello, Aravata. Oh my god, not you. Go away. Uh, no one likes you. <laughs> no one freaking likes you, Ravana. Oh my god. Uh, after hearing you went up to something interesting, you were up to something interesting. I came running right away, you know. <laughs> look, at her, look at her face. I don't remember having you informed. Yeah, it's common to sense. It's, com it's common sense to have some spies planted. I only dropped by to check something. For someone claiming to just be dropping by, the fish stages you dragged um, along look quite formidable. It can't be helped. Fish stage rackshaws are a surefire way to combat that thing when it uses its eyes after all. I just prepared them in case of an emergency. As long as our conversation proceeds peacefully, they won't step forward. So, now you see me? I'll take highly the threats. <laughs> I don't negotiate with terrorists. I don't negotiate. <laughs> or, or I'd fake my strengths. You only thought this was power. Oh, yeah. That's another way, too. You could fake it a little bit. Tell that, tell that ant to kick rocks. Facts. That was my exact reaction to this part. I'm tired of this insect. You insignificant bug. Like, oh, my goodness. Just ruined my whole vibe. <laughs> Just, you're a vibe ruiner. All right. So. Can you cut the bullshit and open the way to that bastard? P pretty pleased. Did you change forms from female to male here? I think, I think, I think, I think so. It, kinda, it looks like the booba left. <laughs> this, looks, this looks like Pex. That looked like Yiddy. <laughs> that looked like Yiddy. <laughs> yes, change to male. Okay. I will slap her out of principle. Big facts. It might be tricky to approach the entrance directly. The Asherahs arrive first. Seeing they brought troops, they seem to intend to fight. It's obvious they came after getting their hands on the news. Um, didn't you say the info was only given to a select few people? Hanuman Nim even took care to only tell me in the secret out of fear that it might get leaked to the Asherah clan. They got wind of it and gathered here so quickly. Just how in the world? There must have been someone in cahoots with the Asuras among those who received the information. Or perhaps the Kinara clan was scheming something different from the very start. It might be that the Kinara clan impli imprisoned? imprisoned Utah under the pretense of 
protecting him and plan to hand him over to the Ashura clan for the actual killing. This way, if something goes wrong, the attempt to kill Yuta, the responsibility will fall on the Asura clan. She don't like that. That's my man. Shout out to my man. He has also he he has been close with the Kanaras and helped them for so long. Yet he is he is evaluating them in that way. Was his favorable attitude just him acting out of obligation? Indra, zap this annoying bug and my life is yours. <laughs> Not you pulling a Kratos, that bozo. Kratos is a loser. I don't know what happens to Ragnarok, but he's still a loser. Um, where was I? Uh, worry about him dying. We wouldn't have to worry about him dying, but because the powers of the number one through three of the Kinaras are unstable, the clan has meticulously collected items that suppress power. If they, if the, their plan was to lock him up, they would have mobilized all those items, so Yuta may not even be able to move properly by now. Yeah, this man knows. His, this man. I'm about to say this man knows his knowledge. This man knows some things. He's got information. Shout out to Vayu. If the Ashura clan invades and attacks him in such a state, it will be fatal. There is a real chance of him dying. No, if that happens, he will resurrect and the situation will become even more serious. That's why we have to act fast. There is no time to find any other methods. We have to go in by ourselves. I know the layout of the Kanara stronghold well and there aren't many places where they could have confined him. It might be possible to sneak without alerting the Asuras. I bet you someone's listening right now. Ah, look at me. Wait. What brings you here? What do you think? I came here because I received the call too. They said... Oh, my mans. Dragon up. Dragon clan. Invisible breath. Shout out to Kasak. We out here. Real clan. Real dragons. I skipped. What did I skip? Why do you... What bubble did I skip? That happens, it'll be more situation, be serious. That's why we have to act fast. No time to find another method. We're going by ourselves. I know the Kanara clan. Up, up, up. More up. You said, you said like 20 panels ago? Oh, I don't, oh it's too late now. <laughs> it's too late. Uh, unless you guys just know literally what which, which panel. Which, what the hell did I miss? Became obvious. Get your hands on the news. Uh -uh. Select people. Get leaked. That quickly. Received word. Kanara clan was scheming something from the start. Then they talk about the actual killing and then not the responsibility not falling on them. Has he's been close with the Kanaras after so long? He's evaluating that way. Is it favorable or obligation? What, what about them dying? Number one, number three are unstable, suppressed power. If their plan was to lock them up, they would have mobilized all the items. I read that. The Ashra clan invades and attacks him in such a way to be fatal from dying. No, if that happens, he would resurrect and the situation become more serious. That's why we have to act fast. There's no time to find any other methods. We'll go in by ourselves. I know the layout of the Kanara stronghold well. There aren't many places where they could have confined him. It might be possible to sneak in without alerting the Asuras. Wait. What brings you here? What do you think? I came here because I received the call too. Um, best clan, no debate. What? What am I? What are you guys talking about? Dog. Di dying. More serious. That's why we have to act fast. I know the stronghold. It might be possible. He looks. He says, wait, question mark. What brings you here? What do you think? I came here because... Just read it out. Type it out loud, man. Everybody else, gods... Just type out. The, the, type it out. Like, I'm, I'm, I don't know. I don't know. Dog. Y'all, y'all, y'all tell me to stop. Tell me to stop, all right? 
I reread these after I react anyways. I'd probably catch it the second time. If the current Utah. I read this. I read this. I literally summarized it. You're talking about worrying about dying and then number one and three being unstable because the whole fact of the matter is him dying is not a good thing. I read it. The whole time I'm thinking I'm missing something down here. All right. I received a call to... They said the Kanara clan was protecting Utah and to let Kubera Lee's know immediately if she arrived. Okay. I didn't think that the that the human would come back after already passing through my nest. So I came here to check out the situation. I didn't expect you to plan something so reckless though. A plan to infiltrate run under the right under the noses of the Asherahs who specializes in stealth? Seriously. Is it okay to not have a Nasica help you if you get caught? Look at this nigga, bro. Yeah, you you the thumbnail. You the thumbnail. Clean, real dragons to be continued. If the current Utah were able to use his eyes and thus deal with the nasty cause, we wouldn't have to worry about him dying. Y'all feel better now? All right. Let's see what they say in the blog post. Curry Gone's blog. Season 3, episode 323 and 29. I'm fucking hot, B. Fuck. I, I need to be shirtless. <sighs> I had no clothes on all day. <laughs> Even though he's a god of wind, does Vayu have a teleport? Vayu does only have a teleportation skill that requires touch like the other gods? Nope. Season 3, episode 196 shows him teleporting a Rakdasa with him. While he has hands in his pocket, so why does Richard release? I know, right? Lee sees, sees puzzle too. I went easy on you. Considering how Vayu predicts the worst situation, there are items even worse than this. But if they use items more potent than needed, unexpected problems can arise. So they choose items to use considering the situation. If the items are too powerful, the problem happening the most is that the Sura which is caught is killed by the items. Oh shoot. And the second is the subject losing their mind and going berserk by unneeded pain. That's interesting. Suras getting sealed off in the middle of a stronghold of a clan isn't a norm in most cases, so one should choose items while considering the situation where they go berserk too. Annoyed, try growing taller too. There was someone asking why male Ravana appears so often wanting female. Ravana to make more appearances. Ra Ravana has a strong male form and his identity leans, leans more towards male than female. Ravana gave birth to many children in female form, even for a high rank sura, but the number of children Ra Ra Ravana has had with females in male form is much greater. He said, You're slinging that meat instead of slinging that clit. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm so childish sometimes. So, however, <laughs> since Ravana's female form is more fun to draw, the amount of female appearances has increased due to my own selfishness to some extent. To faithfully reflect the character setting, Ravana should be in male form in most scenes, except when if, when female form is needed. Okay. Translative note, we'll probably go with him if someone verse Ravana from here on out or use the name instead of a pronoun. Tack looks taller today. Actual height order, Lee's is 178 centimeters, Vayu is 173, Taxaka is 167. I'm taller than all of you. Taxaka doesn't feel bad looking up at others at his current height since his adult form is so tall. It's like the leisure of the rich or something like that. And that is the end of the blog post. All right, how we feel this week? What do y'all say in the chat? I'm catching up the chat. What do y'all say? How we feel this week? How we feel? How we feel? Taxaka gang, real niggas here. Yes, we did. Indra, Zap. It's been a while since I saw Skip a bubble, but of course it happens when Tiara is here. <laughs> she is always here when it happens. <laughs> I'm a Garuda clan member per personally. <laughs> the first value panel after leaves, we skip, blah, blah, blah. Wait, did you skip the same? Everyone else, everybody else, gods included below them. It was the, wait, blah, blah, blah. Doesn't really matter if the current you've already told you this nigga. <laughs> 
You did not. <laughs> I didn't. Maybe I, maybe I read it in my head. <laughs> maybe you're right. I I do that sometimes. I I do that when I'm playing visual novels and I'm and I'm reading text. Look, I didn't. I don't think I read it out loud. But that's my fault though. Sorry, I didn't catch that. Tat kept it promise, huh? Yep. <laughs> Summer weather hitting. I guess he tested Lee to see if she still had faith in the gods. Her future version. Okay. Now I embrace your inner urge to be a Twitch thought. <laughs> You, want, you guys want the bathtub streams? The hot tubs? Hot tub streams? Curry gum getting us the fan service. Favorite part of the chapter was Lee's uh, taking a step back and why you like, nah. Why are you really helping me, though? Damn, didn't really know Lee's was that tall. He's pretty tall. Yeah. I remember correctly, Curry gum said Ravana is stronger than Taxaka. I don't remember that, so I couldn't tell you. Ready to see the dragon step on the insects. Taxaka stomped Ravana, though. I, I'm pretty sure, for sure. I mean, that's Ravana's gimmick. Healing abilities. Way better, but couldn't tell you about all the other stuff. You know, you know what client I'm siding with every time. Dragon up! It's a cool chapter. I'm happy that he kept his promise. I'm ready to see them go ham. Sometimes having a small, dedicated strike force to infiltrate a larger base works. Sometimes you do need more numbers, but. I feel like the three of them could get a lot done. And then freeing Utah also helps a lot too. And you never know what else could happen in the in the meantime. So we'll see how, how things shake up. But hey man, free my guy Utah. Oh yeah, and the finite. Tak also has some special destructive moves. Asura basically bag talk to spare Ravana. Yep. Three good men. <laughs> no, two good two good men and one bad bitch. That's all that's needed. Hey, they got it though. They got it, I believe. I believe. I need some Asha, bro. Bring some Asha back for me, man. I miss Asha. I miss Asha so much. <laughs> I'll be thinking about, like, just what is she doing? She out there still being great. You know what I'm talking about? Also, I wanted to point something out. I want to see if I can remember it. So, Ravano just wants smoke. I just don't like you. Is that just me? Does anyone else? Does anyone here like? Is anyone here a Ravana stan? I just had a. I don't care if you do. I'm just curious. I don't. I just don't like Rav. I just don't like you. No, <laughs> you make my blood boil the same way Indra does. One second. No hell no. Talking about Vishnu, out. In the final, it was mentioned that talking destroy the time uh, th can destroy time of an individual. Oh shit! I'm a certified bug hater. Mine is Hura. Shout out to Hura. Shout out to Hura. Are there any are there, are there any insects that I like? I think I think a lot of y'all like Sagara. So there's that. I pray for Asha's uh, failure daily. Ravana too. <laughs> I'm not mad at it, but team Asha out though. Ravana in the same tier with Indra and Chandra of the world. What's wrong with Chandra? What's wrong with my nigga Chandra? You just pragmatic. That's all. To a fault maybe, but you know you just out here doing what you gotta do. I don't. I don't dislike Chandra, but I'm not mad at that. She's the same age as. She's the same as Sagara. She's irritating, but at least she's consistent about it. Fair. Sagara is an Anata member. Oh shit, that's true. I'm, my bad. What the what's, what the fuck's wrong with me? G snakes. Great snake. Asha is not out. What do you mean? She's the one. When was the last time we saw Asha when Sierra gave back the bracelet? I think when Asha pulled up on Lila. Asha had a conversation with somebody pretty recently. I, think, I don't know if it was around that time. I feel like Lila and Asha had a convo or something. Somebody. I can't remember who. But it was a few chapters ago. like Or, or arcs ago. But like. I want to say about 30 chapters ago or so. Something like that. I miss Lila who cares about Asha. Alila who cares about Asha. Yes, Lila. Yeah, yeah. I think it, I think it was... No, not Ryan Time, time Travels. Definitely we've seen, we've seen her after that. I know it was after that. But um, unless you're saying Ryan, Ryan did see her also in the time... Oh, wait, in the room. In the room. I got you saying. In the, in, the, in the white space. I got you. I got you. I got you. Her last appearance was negotiating with Sagara. Was it Sagara then? Maybe it was Sagara. Okay. I know she was talking to somebody. I hate Sagara so much. Imagine trying to receive somebody you only like the concept of. 
in the white space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With Sagara, yeah, yeah. I miss her though. It just, it, it just like for me. This, this is this, this is not a bad thing, by the way. This is just like there was there was a huge shift in like a paradigm shift in how the story was told and how things were conceptualized and kind of just the storytelling when Asha was removed from the main party in a sense because a lot of stuff was filtered through her and you're always wondering what she was up to and what she was getting down to. Could we trust her? Could we not trust her? And that was for a portion of the story. Obviously, when she revealed what she was really trying to do and get done, that changed. Just hasn't been the same in some ways. So I just, I just kind of miss it. That's all. Wasn't the conversation with Lila after the time travel arc? I should reread again. That's the, I, I couldn't even tell you. That's, that's, I'll let y'all tell me. I don't even remember. Y'all know I don't remember nothing. I'm, I'm old. My brain don't work the same. Can't hate a character if it's hot. Hold on. Are you right? Are you correct about that? You might be onto something. <laughs> now, <laughs> I might say you look good, but I don't like you. But you might, you might be onto something. I think it's because I respect her plots more than anything, so I don't hate Cigar as much. I got, I got you. My Cigar, if I remember correctly, is one of the ten m main characters Curry Gum had mentioned a while, a while, a while, a while, a while back. I think of like Anata, Yuta, M Maruna, Cigar, Lee's. I don't remember the rest, but maybe I'm wrong. So yeah, I think Sagara's hot. I still dislike her. Well, Sagara, I, you know me. When it comes to the to the Suras and Nasikas and stuff, because they can, they can switch. I'm good. Give me the pure blooded humans. Give me the quarters. I might fuck with a half. I don't want or I, I'm you know like I'm good off that. Like toxic masculinity form Sagara. What if she does that? <laughs> you know what? I mean, let me let me keep my demonic thoughts to myself. Love how even with the shift from Astra, the story's still goaded. Big facts. It is. It is. It is. Hot characters only get brownie points from a 1 out of 10 to a 5 out of 10. I always say that about series. If you have a lead looking... If your characters look good, you get a 5 from me. This is why fairy tale will never be less than a 5. They look good! That's just proof of Curry Gum's pen. Her pen is, ins is insane. I still crack up on Curry Gum killing off characters with a beard. <laughs> Also, hers be like, I've been drawing Ravana in female form just for myself because I want to. Even though he should be in male form more often. Now he sired more children with his meat than he did with the cleat. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jesus. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, she's still hot, even in toxic masculinity form. No homo. She don't look good like my nigga Rao. See, he he's gorgeous. Rao? Aren't I handsome? I was like, yes, you are. I'm trying to be in some Sagara guts, especially for the older ones. I know they free. <laughs> some Sura guts. Oh, I don't know, man. I'm, 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 I'm the person that says no to Melina when all my friends say yes from Mortal Kombat. I'm like, no. I'm, I'm terrified. I'm scared. <laughs> and I got it like that. I could pick and choose. I don't, I don't got to submit. I'm interested in the item, the items concept of the, because of the unstableness in the fluctuation of power between the top. You know who's an exception though? For me? Stay on track. Um, the powers is like, I kind of want to see it. I, I want to see it. The S is in the name. Semfanti, yeah. Like, a Sura that's being like held down by weapons and they actually die because the weapons are so powerful that kills them or they actually lose their mind and go crazy. I think that's an interesting concept of having to kind of subdue strong folks because of the fluctuation of power. That's interesting. I like that she added that. I thought that made a lot of sense. When I was reading it based on the nature of their cloud and how things kind of work, I thought that was cool. I like it. Also, how the M is in Maruna. Aruna. I want Aruna back. With the with the with the what was it called again? A snowflake apple? I need that. I think a snowflake apple would taste good though. I think that's what it was called. Agni, Kubera, Ganhavra, Lee's, Asha, Sagara, Yuta, Maruna, Ran, Brilith, I think. I miss my girlfriend Brilith too. Agni, come outside, bro. I'm, I'm ready. I will I will defeat the concept of fire <laughs> or die trying. <laughs> 
I got the red on my head. All right? <laughs> oh, man. I still play for a Murugan flashback. Why? <laughs> Why Murugan? I got curious, so I went to look. And from Season 3 Prologue, the 10 main characters are Lee's, Asha, Brill, Agni, Kubera, Ganhavra, Sagara, Yuta, Maruna, and Rand. So, so Brill is not there. Okay. Oh, wait. No, Brill is there. Who are the top three? Do we know? Kinara, Aravata, and... You say Kamadu, probably? I guess that makes sense. Based on what just happened. Is, Ch 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 is Chitana a bug, too? I will pull up on a bona fide ice user and pull up on icy. I will become a bona fide ice user and my power is unstable. Um, what I was going to say a little earlier is, um, wow, I completely lost it. Never mind. I was going to tell you the one, the one Sura I'll make an exception for, <clears throat> but whatever. Give me Ushas. Give me Brilith. Give me Lila. I'm good. Give me Lila. Chandra won't fight me to the death for Lila. I know he... <laughs> I can smell the hole in you. <laughs> he already dead. He can come bike, though. He can come bike. Yeah, I understand Lila. I still need the Lila merch. I need a shirt. I need the earmuffs. <laughs> and I want the mask. I don't care. I'm still... I'm, I still find it hilarious that I really read like the first season and didn't realize Lila was covering her face with something. I thought I thought Lyle looked like that. <laughs> it's funny. It's funny the attention to detail I don't notice sometimes. It reminds me of me not knowing and Dorsey had a horn until like my fourth reread. So yeah, what Kendrick said. I know we got some hole in them. Yeah, that's crazy. It is crazy. It is crazy. Sometimes I don't be paying attention to like the to 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 the minute details and the artistry sometimes especially when I'm catching up to something cuz I'm trying to get through it as fast as possible so that, that that's just on me that's just me it's really with repeat it's really with repeated reads where I discover more and more and more things this is why like when you hear me speak, speak about something you're like wow he's very knowledgeable don't assume I just played that game once or watched that show once like I seen Smallville a 100 million thousand times since it came out that's why I know it at the back of my hand I'm not the person, like, yeah, anyway, so yeah. Low-key, the Lila mask is fire now? It is. I love it. It's trademark, bro. It's so clean. When I first found out who was on it there, I was just mad she hit her face, but the mask was cool. She had her reasons, though. She had her reasons. The endorsey horn is acceptable even, but her eyes get a few panels with nothing but a close-up of them. <laughs> I'm blind. I'm old. All right? So I don't have I have 120 vision. <laughs> it just is what it is. What does the word bug mean in the context of the story? You mean, you mean in Kubera? We're just talking about the clan. The Ashura clans are insects. They're centipedes, millipedes. When they like fully serify, they're like amalgamations of different types of bugs. And I don't know that we've seen any arachnids, anything of the sort, but they're the, they're the Ashura clan. Yeah, ants and all that. I don't think we see... Because if someone turns into a spider, y'all know I, I can't read it. I don't like spiders, bro. So. <coughs> ah! <coughs> I'm alive. I'm good. Trachea, trachea. Oh, God. Wrong pipe. <coughs> God damn. Uh, holy. I almost died on stream. This is like the, this is like the remember the taco almost took me out five years ago on stream? The taco? The access level um taco? <coughs> almost got taken out by a drink. That's crazy. A bug is a bug. I'm not gonna lie, I was determined the whole effing clan couldn't have couldn't ha couldn't have me in there. That's crazy. The bug hater shot Gustang where the raid at. The taco came back. <laughs> yeah. The raid's killing his chest. <clears throat> I definitely I definitely got like a a powerful swig of that, but it it really because it went down my windpipe. And that being said, we're in a, we're in a, we're in a good arc. I didn't I didn't expect any of the things these things to happen in N twenty, all things considered. I'm trying to think where I thought I was going to go, but from the moment I seen Rachel like this, I just looked over 
because she wanted to visit them. I'm like, where are we going? What's going to happen? So, this should be interesting. Anybody worried about Utah? We're always in good. We're always in the good arc. That's a fact. I was I was literally saying this because, again, I apologize for not doing it. Why is this, why is it so dirty? For not doing it Friday, but for anyone doesn't know, real quick, we never used to have that. We used to have carpet. We got rid of all the carpet for hardwood, so obviously I had to move move things out of the rooms and move things out of whatever. And in the like me moving things in and out of my room, I'd actually lost the cord for this mic. I didn't have it. So I know I did a little stream Friday, but I was using my own mic my, my old mic from the standpoint and that one it, it cuts in and out. It's, I threw it out, it doesn't work. So I couldn't even stream because I didn't have a microphone until I found the cord on Saturday on Sunday. So Glam and I are going to be ranking all the Kubera arcs, tier list style. So stay tuned for that. My guess is Thursday of this week, because I think I think tomorrow I'm going to answer the I'm going to do the Tower God theories tomorrow, and then Wednesday, um, Pat and I are going to do the J Cole, our favorite twenty J Cole songs. <clears throat> so probably Thursday. So yeah, slide for that. Friday, I don't know. I might not be here because I have to prepare for the barbecue. But anyways, we're always in a good arc. Fact. <clears throat> there is no bad arcs in Kurigam. I can only point to you one chapter that I ever read where I was unmoved. That doesn't mean the chapter was bad. Doesn't mean it was trash. It doesn't mean it was whatever. But like, I would be fine if I never read that chapter. And that's just a side story with Brilliant's dad in it. That one chapter. I just, with, what's his name, Tal, Talbith? I just didn't care for that chapter at all. That's it, so. <clears throat> worried about Utah? Nah, we gotta be worried for the universe. <laughs> I actually love that gimmick, though, where, like, someone is so strong or whatever. People be, people don't be, be worried about them. They be worried about, their, like, that person, like, snapping and going crazy. Okay, yeah, more or less. Tia's about to go crazy. That would be the shortest stream. Just put everything in S tier. <laughs> no, it won't be like that. Um, and you know, and you guys know how glam is. Glam is arguably. I don't know if you guys think glam is more or less critical than I am, but I'll say this: I I believe the lowest tier will be like B, like it's gonna be like S, A plus, A A minus B. <laughs> so B will be the lowest rank, but no, 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 we're not gonna do that. <clears throat> All the arcs. I expect a six-hour stream. Them no. I'm telling you right now, don't expect that. <laughs> I'm going to do like a top 10, so top 10 arcs. Um, yeah, it will not be six hours. <laughs> I promise you that. Um, sorry, wait, Floor of Death? One chapter, love to see it. That's not even a main story chapter. There you go. I remember that chapter came and went. Yeah, I just not moved by it. It's not a bad chapter, just eh, I don't really care for it. 90% of arcs, S. We'll see when we get to it, ladies and gentlemen. What was our favorite panel? I want to say this one, but Ravana's ugly, so fuck off. Where's where's my dragon? Where are you at? Where are you at? This, this, this was my favorite panel. Woo! Yeah! Yeah! Dragon Clan, baby. Can't go wrong! This is my favorite panel. What about what about Chow? But for real, that swaggy panel of my ninja. Yep. You said everyone, everyone said Yiddy. <laughs> what, was, what was my favorite piece of dialogue? <laughs> Probably the part where they're talking about the items and how they have to carefully choose what they use because they can kill somebody or make them go mad. I don't know why that moved me a lot. It moved me. I like that part. That was that was tight. And maybe the. Maybe the panel that I apparently, allegedly, supposedly skipped. But I don't think I skipped it, Skill. I don't know about that, Skill. Skill. I can't even do it. I can't even sound like that guy. He's so, so, he's, he's so country. Uh, Lee's and 
Utah chilling. I'm, I'm with that one. I like that. I'm at an 8.5 this week out of 10. Great chapter. That's how to rank it. Don't know what you guys are rated as. I'm, I'm, I'm around there. If you guys want to share your rankings with me, and then we're going to move on. Oh, it's going to thank the Kubera Gang Arena for um, popping up and showing through. I do have some interesting Kubera streams I've been cooking up, so just, keep, just stay tuned. <clears throat> I'm probably going to test it with the Patreon first, but yeah. Also 8.5. That's what's up. That's what's up. But if you guys don't have any further commentary or questions, I will move forward. Patreon. I don't know why I did all that. <laughs> Shout out to the CBLs, certified BAM lovers. I appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. They be loving BAM, La Bam, James. Shout out to the priest of Fardo. These are the certified Brillith lovers. They might be the real CBLs. Appreciate y'all. And a big shout out to the fifth Zen gods, the tier threes. Shout out to Big Abdel, Abdi Malik, Childish New Jabez, Fairs, Huey, Johnny Rogers. Shout out to Big Mod Katan, Lazy Dragon. Shout out to Lopo Be a Blaze, Naz Riley, Revenant, Rox G, S, Scobe, Simi, Sly, Tao, Tino Brown, Urek Masino, Wolf General, Zodiac, Namiko, and Zyler Scotty, your support is greatly appreciated. Thank you. I had grass dipped in honey today. Yeah, nutrition. <laughs>